Hello dear friends, welcome. Uh, in today's video, uh, I will show you that how you can calculate some of the numbers and uh, average of the marks. So coming towards uh, this imaginary sheet where I have awarded marks to uh, different names. For example, here are some names A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, and these are the numbers of uh, in the respective subjects. For example, in subject 1, 70, subject 2, 80, subject 3, 98, subject 4, 87, and subject 5, 67. So I will calculate average of, uh, no, sorry, I will calculate average marks as well as total marks of each student. Now coming towards uh, the serial number which I have left intentionally, uh, I will add here 1. After adding 1, just I will drag it here. Here you can see that there are different options. So I will click fill series. Now you can see, uh, for example, I want to calculate the sum of these marks that is for student A. So clicking here in this section, in this cell, I will click here equal and uh, now I will write SUM sum formula and break it in. And the starting from the subject one and dragging like this one up to the subject file. Now I will close the bracket and click enter. Here you can see that uh, all the marks have been added. Now dragging this cell downwards. So here you will see that all the marks will be added for each student. So this was a very easy and that how you can add marks or any number uh, in a row as well as in the column. For example, now we want to uh, to to calculate uh, subject five marks. So I will click equal and again I will write sum and now I will drag downwards. So here you can see that it worked again. And I bring it. Uh, so this is uh, this is the total marks which I have obtained through the formula that is equal sum starting from the subject one to subject five. Now calculating the average or mean of these of the marks for every single student. So I will write here mean. Now I will click the formula. So adding the formula equal to average. Now I will start from subject number one to subject five and I will click enter. So now you, you can see here that the mean has also calculated. Dragging it downwards, now you can see that uh, mean of each student has been calculated. This mean shows us the average marks of all the five subjects. Hope you got uh, the calculation of sum and average. Now I want to uh, to watch the marks which are greater than uh, 400. So I will apply here the conditional formatting. You can see here in the conditional formatting highlight sales rules and I will click greater than. I will click here 400 and click OK. So these are the marks which are greater than 400 and highlighted. Again, I want to remove the conditional formatting. So coming here and clicking clear rules from the selected as well as you can see, but, but I have uh, done nothing in except only the column H. So I will click from uh, ru uh, clear rules from entire sheet. So you can see whenever 
wherever wherever any rule have been applied it will be removed thank you